Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey here, and I'm here with Ore Collection. That's right, we're back with some Ore Collection because uh, Ore Collection finally updated, which is crazy. And as you can see here, here's a bunch of Japanese that I have no idea what they're talking about. So thankfully, our good old buddies down at OCHD the people who are the reason that anyone was ever 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 able to play or collection or jump empty is that what it's called jumpetti 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 the jump games their uh ochd does a lot of the translation and of course is the main reason why anyone was able to play or collection and it is a uh, a fantastic um fantastic fantastic people over there so they translate it and this is basically the update or Collection 2 update information. Maintenance for Or Collection 2 will be carried out in the near future. Maintenance will last for one to two weeks. Players will not receive any rewards from the last season of Legends Arena. The stages of takeover process will be carried out as follows. Um, rework report. This notice. Uh, maintenance. One to two weeks. Application update. Rework goes live. Operation environment. Or Collection 2 has undergone significant changes, including the jump from 2D to 3D. For this reason, the system requirements to play the games have increased. Android, at least Android 4.4, OpenGL 3.0. iOS, at least Apple 8A, CPU, at least iOS, iOS 9.0. This is where you see this right here. Important, during maintenance, you cannot perform account link to transfer or collection data. And that is the basic summation. So what does this all mean? It basically means that, uh... Or collection is coming back for the foreseeable um, future and that's really it is that we've been waiting for this news basically everyone's been waiting um, actually a lot of people were starting to say there's no way that this game is coming out in 2019 even though they told us it's coming out in 2019 that's how crazy long it's been so it looks like it's finally happening the jump to 3d means that we're gonna lose a lot of the a lot of this stuff man this is it it's fine. It's we're finally in the end game for or collection. It's finally time to say goodbye to this thing that's been on my phone and basically just waiting to be played once again. And currently my my mood on this is like I I'm cautiously optimistic. I remember when or collection shut down. I didn't like any of the look of or collection 2. I thought it was a definite downgrade when I saw the 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 screenshots so many months ago. Um, I don't know how I'll feel. I definitely am someone who prefers 2D over 3D, so I think that won't change. Um, but I'm willing to give it a shot if it's better playing and it's better maintained and it's better everything. If the gameplay is the same, then I will keep playing and I'll have a fun time, but, um, very cautiously optimistic. I'm looking forward to seeing what happens next. Um, and that's basically it. And that's kind of it for War Collection right now. I actually came in here to um do one final look at all the some of the uh, some of all the five star uh, manga manga panels i don't know why i suddenly forgot how to say manga um i just want to look at them so here why won't we everyone's you know if you're here that's the news basically everyone there's not much else to report we continue to wait actually let me look at the pvp season um this pvp pvp season ends on the 4th of november so we'll see. We'll see if it's still up and running from there. But um, hmm. I'll be very interested if they're gonna do one full rotation and then, um, and then they'll uh, actually do it. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. I'll just continue to wait. Hopefully November is when it comes in, and then maybe by end of November we'll play it. But who knows? I want to look at some of these five star panels because I think they're. I don't know if they're gonna be following us there, so I wanted my wanted to check them out. One last time. This is from Kaniku Man. This is from when Kaniku Man is fighting. That's Robin Mask. Uh, I forget the name of you. You're you're a robot man though. Oh, there's the Kaniku the Kaniku Buster. Oh, so so clean. That robot's like entire taint is just like in full view. Oh. Yeah, just look at this. Look at this like art. It's still so good. It captured it captures an emotion, even though half of I'm gonna say there's no more there's no more there's no way more than two people know uh, Kaniku Man. I love Kaniku Man, but not a lot of people saw it. Here's the next one. This is from Captain Subasa. Let's check it out. 
Captain Tsubasa, everyone's favorite. I love Captain Tsubasa. Uh, que pasa, Tsubasa? All right. Here's Tsubasa. He's kicking. He's diving for the ball. He's going for the goal line. Now this has to be him doing the eagle kick, right? Oh, he's on the floor. He's running. Oh, man. He's going to get it. I wish I knew what they were saying. I don't, though. It's fine. Boom. Yeah, that's, I think, the golden kick. I guess he's saying his soliloquy. These were always also very long and very well detailed. It's it's not gonna stop till it shows us where that soccer ball's heading. Go for it. Go for it. No, it's going straight into the air. Alright. That's the end of it. I did not read far enough into Captain Subasa to know what any of that meant. Alright, this one is Fist of the North Star. Funny enough, I've never, I think, fully read Fist of the North Star. I've definitely started it in parts. I, I want to say this is him fighting one of the bad guys. I don't know which bad guy, so excuse me for that one. He comes off the top rope. Kinshiro's like, oh no, he jumped. He's going to get him. Kinshiro says, no. Oh, not order, order. I forget what he says. Clean punch. They're fighting on top of a pyramid. That's a very good reveal. Corte. I forget what, what, what. No, he doesn't say. You are already dead. There you go. I was about to say awarded that, but no, that's. That just means it's over. Oh, I know this one. This is Dragon Ball. This is. Shenron's first summon, the first time you see Shenron. There's Oolong and Puar. Oolong's wondering, how can I stop Pilaf? There's no one here with active fighting ability. What can I possibly do? Pilaf's like, I'm finally be doing it. I'm gonna do it. And then Oolong says, I want the most comfortable pair of panties. And everyone's like, what? And then the universe gives him one single teardrop of panties. Shenron says, take care of those panties, boy. And he flies off. And Pilaf goes, what? And there you go. That's the end of that. Oh, I forgot that there's so many for for Dragon Ball. They really made sure that the most loved series get a lot of five, five panels. Oh, who is that? General... It's, General... it's not General Red. I forget his name. He's the leader of the Red Ribbon Army. So it might be General Red. He shoots Goku in the back of the head. He's going to go, ah, oh, I'm going to take you down. Android 8 gets pissed because he's Frankenstein. How dare you, you short-ass little man. I'm going to beat the hell out of you with my giant Frankenstein monster abilities. And he punches him straight out the... Is it called Muscle Tower? I don't think it's called Muscle Tower. He punches him out of there, though. All right. And here's another one. Oh, this one's very good. This is the Frieza one. This is when, oh no, Frieza's pissed. Frieza's talking down to him, saying, I don't know what happened to the Dragon Balls, but it doesn't look too good. Goes down. He's very angry, even though he's smiling. You can tell that this is a, a little man on the edge. He screams at them. How dare you? You ruined everything. All right, let's see. Ah, oh, yes. This is the Krillin one. Goku going Super Saiyan for the first time. This is right. No, he's going to do it. He's about to do it. It's a shame Dokkan never actually, like, um, animated this as an active skill or something. Man, they even animated, like, his chest going up. It's very nicely detailed. Frieza laughs. My dog Cotton is angry that what, what Frieza's done. Goku goes Super Saiyan for the first time, saying, It's over, Frieza! And then you get an SR from that specific animation. I wonder which one is this one. Is this the one where Yamcha sees Bulma naked? I think it is. 
No, it's not. It's the one where... Okay, I always have problems with this one because people always said Yamcha was on par with Goku, and that's not true. Yamcha could never beat a half-starved Goku. Yamcha sees Bulma for the first time. He gets extremely horny. He falls over. Short, sweet, and to the point, really. Right, let's see. I'm surprised they never made a Super Saiyan um, 2 Gohan one, now that I think about it. Alright, let's see. Let's end it off with one more. I forget. Did they ever make one for the 2010s? Yes, they did. I want to say it was Assassination Classroom. Uh, let me see if we can find it. Let's see. That, yeah, that's just the Assassination Classroom one. There has to be more, though. Yeah, there was a My Hero one. Uh, did they ever make a Uno? Oh, we're ending it on a Uno one. Oh, I like this one, too. This one's a very sweet one. Out of all the manga panels to animate from Yuna, uh, I'm glad that they showed the self-restraint to only animate the one where it's the one where he dances with Yuna for the first time. This is where um, he's at. I think it's at a school festival somewhere. I think that's what I remember it. Yeah. And at this point, the main character has been kind of been treated as like a weirdo. But he wants to show that it doesn't matter to him. And he dances with Yuna. He says, she wants to dance. We're going to dance. It doesn't matter what people say to me. Let's dance. And I think it's a very sweet moment in a, a extremely booby-focused -fo um, manga, honestly. And it's, it's little moments like that which remind me why I think Yuna is so good. Oh man, I forgot that there was even ones based off of, um... If you want to know how old Orc Collection was, there is... N this is the only Nezuko panel one. So this is before, or um... They hit big. So, alright. I think that was some... Let me see, let me see if there's one more we can show off. Uh... Oh, the Slam Dunk one's really good. I want to end it off, though, on the real fun one. Let's see. Um, is there a Yu Yu Hakusho one? There is. I'm not sure if that's the one I want to end it on, though. <laughs> Taking requests now, I guess. I can't. If you... If you leave a comment, I will not tell you anything. You will not tell me anything. Okay, you know what? Because it has so much focus about being dead, we need to do the one where Yusuke figures out he's dead. Spoilers. It's the one where he saves Captain Tsubasa. See, the ball goes into the middle of the road. Shusuke says, you dumb kid, what are you doing? The car comes right at the kid. Yusuke has no time. The car's gonna run him over. Yusuke saves the kid. Yusuke dies. And that's it. And then from this point on... Yusuke must figure out a way to come back to life. That's not true. He was actually 100% ready to die. And then Botan said, um, We fucked up. Um, you weren't supposed to die. We didn't expect you to actually save that boy. So with that, that's today's video. I hope you liked it. It's really just me kind of reminiscing on Orc Collection. I don't want to play right now. Because I don't want to get a feeling of how Orc or Correction, or Correction or Collection felt like. So... Until next time, hopefully the next time we do an, an Orc Collection video, the game will be out. And we'll maybe do some summons. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, goodbye everyone. Have a nice day.